Yeah, when you like to change language, it's here. And it's also depending if you select live or not. And yeah, so that's about if you have like a formal license, you can't change. It's English because you bought it in English and we made it translatable. So you need ultimate, at least free version and opt-in to Evergreen and then you can select here. Then you have all the languages available. And these are the languages we have files for and there's a knowledge base about add new webinar languages. Also we will translate it for you. Uh, machine translated if you give us the name of the language you want this person was doing a 30 days trial and then he can select so she complained about yeah that every webinar is English but she's a German person and here you see it was set in English. There was um, on creating the webinar English selected and no way to get it back because to change it because all the emails are already English. Everything's English. Every placeholder is English. So the easiest way would be to redo the webinar. Also import export webinar not working because we import export also the strings. Um, yeah, there's one other if you have like in brackets auto translated or auto set then your webinar was created and then you update it to a version with multiple languages. So but then it's still English and still sticked with English. Yeah sorry for that and if you want to keep yeah, you need to do the new webinar so you can select German and then everything will be in German mm, I would say you do just the two here edit and save and you get new URL and on the new webinar you don't use the two so then you have the same URL if you shared it already so we'll have the, the non-working one will have a two here, check it, and the other one will be here. And you need to do this before, then this URL is free again. Okay, sorry for this work, but you see that's a lot of strings to translate, maybe 2000 strings that are already translated for you. One more thing is select. The language you want and also do yes so you have German and German and yeah that's a German website and everything is in English sorry for that for the moment um, but um, yeah it's on the list to do but it will be if you create a webinar test test de and everything will be in German from now on. You see, everything is in German. Mails are in German. And here, the language is German, also not changeable. You have extra settings for date and time. That's here, but it's not changing the languages. Okay, that's for the moment. And thanks, Andrea, for showing me this and give her this information. Best regards to BS.